the ruling party in India and the Prime Minister India Narendra Modi, what do they do? From the Indian Constitution, they delete Act Number 370. Most of you may not be knowing about Act Number 370. When India, when the Britishers left, they divided India into three parts. West Pakistan, East Pakistan, which later on became Bangladesh and India. Why? Because they wanted to divide the Muslim into three. So one third went to Pakistan approximately, one third went to Bangladesh, one third stayed in India. And later on they divided East and West Pakistan, three different countries, let the Muslim side. Kashmir opted, okay, we don't mind joining India under the condition that we are independent. So in the Indian constitution, Article 370 says that Kashmir is independent. It will have its own constitution. It will have its own laws. It will have its own government. They may be in the umbrella of India, but they are independent. No non-Kashmiri can come and buy land in Kashmir. All this is mentioned. 70 years later, The BGP government, which is anti-Islamic government, what do they do? They want to scrap this. And only way they can do is by getting majority in the lower house and upper house, Rajya Sabha and Lok Sabha. And recent election, they got the majority in both the houses. And they scrapped this. It is unconstitutional. And they made it into a union territory. There are some Muslim countries objecting, but we aren't united. And Robert Fisk wrote an article on 28th of February 2019, a few months before. He said that when I heard the news that terrorist camps are being attacked, terrorists are being killed, and the main center is being destroyed. I thought this is news of Israel bombing Palestine, maybe Gaza Strip, maybe Syria. Then he hears Balakot in Pakistan. India in February attacked Pakistan and claimed that it destroyed terrorist camps. Robert Fix said they may have hit rocks and stones, but to show the people. And the Prime Minister of India said there were clouds, so you could not see properly. But I ordered the Air Force, even if the clouds go and attack. Today, the radars, the clouds cannot stop the radar. So I, our Prime Minister is so scientifically educated that he thinks that the clouds can stop the radar. In which age are we living? Robert Fish says that India is against Pakistan being trained by Israel. Who's saying this, Robert Fisk? UK. And that came in the independent, independent newspaper in UK. I'm not saying that. And he says future there's going to be divide. That means now they are learning how Palestine was destroyed and overtaken by Israel, now they want to do it to Kashmir. What is the Muslim Ummah doing? Nothing. 